Okay, so today I will be showing you guys how to take uh, your video off the camera, the Canon camera, and put it onto the computer and then import it into iMovie. Um, a lot of students ask me every time they want to upload, so rather than asking me every time, I'm just going to do a quick video to give you uh, the rundown. So, step one is, of course, to make sure that your white USB cable is hooked up to the back of the iMac. Okay, so you hook up that white cable and then make sure that the other end is connected to your Canon uh, video camera. Okay, when you do that, as you guys just saw, um, iPhoto pops up. Okay, so you click on the first video that you want to copy and you get a yellow box around it, hold down shift and then click on the last video that you want to copy. Okay, and then hit import selected. Okay, so it is now importing at this very moment. And we'll go ahead and wait. Should not take too long because this is a fast computer. Okay, looks like we've got some track uh, video on here. Okay, make sure that once you have imported those videos that you delete whatever's on that camera. We need to keep everything off of that camera hard drive so we don't get clutter. Okay, uh, next step. Okay, we need to get it out of iPhoto and into iMovie. So what I do in order to make this process simpler is I go and click on the desktop. So over here is your desktop. If you press control, hold down control and then click and then you'll get this uh, pop-up window, click on new folder, okay, call this, I'm going to call it track, so it should describe something that you're downloading, so I'm just going to call this track, I'm not sure exactly who filmed this and for what reason, but I'm just going to keep it simple right now. Alright, and then I'm going to go ahead and click, again, top one, click on bottom one, and then I'm going to drag it down into that folder which I created, just called track. Okay, it should be in there. If I click in there, now I've just moved my videos from uh, iPhoto into my desktop so I can quickly access them. If I go into my iMovie now, and I don't see iMovie down here in my dock, so I'm going to have to go to iMovie by hitting Go. When I go to Go, I go to Applications. Applications, you see iMovie comes up. I'm going to go ahead and put that down here in my dock. Click it open. Give it one second to load. This is a pretty heavy uh, program, so it might take a little bit longer to load. Okay, continue. All right, I am now in iMovie. I'm going to go ahead and go to File, and I'm going to say a new <laughs> movie. Okay. I don't like themes. I'm going to double click it. I'm going to call it track just for simplicity's sake. Event. Okay, hit OK. Okay, so if I come over here, 2014, where did track go? iMovie Library. Let's go to All Projects. We've got track. Okay, I'm going to go to File. Um, now I need to bring my media into here, so I'm going to import media okay if I this window pops up and now I want to go to my desktop because that's where I put my folder then I've got this folder called track and I can hit top video click down to the bottom video once again holding down shift and you can say import all and right now it is moving those videos from my desktop and into iMovie so that I can use it. When it's ready to go, I think it's going to show up up here. This is a new version of iMovie, which I still have to play around with and figure out. But this is how we move our videos from our camera into iPhoto, onto our desktop, and eventually into iMovie. Hopefully that answers your questions and you don't have to... Uh, if, you could, you could just kind of click through through this tutorial and it'll help you do it step by step. Um, thanks.
that's it. Bye.